At the beginning of 2022, the Meerkat radio telescope detected a strange and unique signal in the Vela X1 region of the sky. There, 1300 light years from Earth, dead neutron stars have found their last resting place. Previously, no pulses from stars or other activity has ever been seen there. So what strange and mysterious object was sending radio signals from a dead part of space? Scientists figured out that it was the neutron star labelled PSR J0901-4046. Now, neutron stars are usually spinning really fast. Their rotation periods range between 1.4 milliseconds and 30 seconds. But as they age, their spin slows down. And because of that, they also stop emitting radio bursts. But this star takes as much as 76 seconds to complete one revolution and still produces pulses. In fact, it has seven different types of them. Scientists say they've never seen anything like that before. The weakened PSR J0901406 has almost run out of power. Its signals last about 300 milliseconds which is only 0.5% of the rotation period of the star. So astronomers were lucky that, just for a moment, a radio beam crossed the Earth and they were able to detect it. One idea is that it belongs to a rare class of ultra-long period magna stars or stars with very strong magnetic fields. If so, the star marks the beginning of a new class of neutron stars. And there could be a whole lot of them out there. But that's not the only star that caught scientists' attention. Prepare to learn about how a star can blow smoke rings, how black holes can eject unwanted space bodies, what happens when stars feed off each other, and how stars continue to live on after exploding. Black holes are known to pull celestial bodies inside by their insane gravity once an object is close enough. But, as it turns out, such black hole monsters are also capable of slingshotting celestial bodies through space at incredible speeds. It's possible that something like this could have happened to S5 HSV1. In the past, the star orbited a companion as part of a binary system but they came too close to Sagittarius A star. The monster black hole captured the companion star with its gravity, and S5 HSV1 was ejected at thousands of kilometers per second. Scientists suggest that the event occurred about 5 million years ago. But there are other stars out there who have insane behavior and defy logic. KIC 8462852, or Tabby Star, from the constellation Cygnus, stands out for its brightness. The star orbits at a distance of about 1470 light years from Earth. It's slightly more massive, hotter, and brighter than the Sun. One of the most resonant cosmic stories in recent years has been about Tabby's star. The star became famous in 2015, when the Kepler Space Telescope recorded a decrease in its luminosity over the span of several days. The star's brightness dropped by about 20% and then gradually began to increase. 
In addition, Tabby's star has consistently had much fainter but long-lasting dimming. Such phenomena have never been observed in other stars slightly larger than the Sun. Believers of extraterrestrial civilizations immediately started talking about the megastructure of a distant, highly evolved civilization. According to their vision, alien intelligent life periodically takes energy from the star for their own needs and, by doing so, dims its light. But recent research by NASA's Spitzer and Swift missions have refuted this idea. Astronomers recorded a smaller dimming of Tabby star in the infrared spectrum, and aliens certainly had nothing to do with it. Scientists have put forward their hypothesis of the anomalous behavior of the star. The cause of the long and weak periods of low light may lie in uneven movement of the dust cloud around the star. Any object larger than the tiniest dust particle would darken the star when passing in front of it. Researchers say the dust around Tabby star may not be small enough to evaporate into space, but it's also not large enough to evenly block the entire spectrum of light waves. Particles with a diameter of no more than one ten thousandth of an inch, or about a few micrometers, fit these parameters. The period of rotation of the cloud, according to the researchers' calculations, is about 700 days. So far, they haven't been able to pinpoint the exact source of the dust. It could be dust from a swarm of passing comets, remnants of planetary collisions, or particles of matter from interstellar space. The story isn't over for the legendary Tabby star, and scientists will continue studying it. Who knows what surprises it may reveal in the future. But stars don't only travel fast or shine bright, there's more. This is the star named HD 140283, located in the constellation Libra, 190 light years away from Earth. Also known as the Methuselah star, it was studied in 2000 in an attempt to determine its age. But how is that even possible, given the universe is only 13.8 billion years old? If you'd like to hear the full story about this star, let us know in the comments. Something strange is also happening to another star in the Milky Way. Using the ALMA telescope, scientists have discovered a debris disk surrounding the star. Generally, it's not uncommon for stars to have debris left from the formation of their systems orbiting them. But no other star has a debris disk with such a complicated structure. HD 53143 is a yellow dwarf star with a mass of about 80% and a luminosity of 70%, that of the Sun. It's located 60 light years away from Earth in the Carina constellation. The star is young, just about 1 billion years old. So it's not surprising HD 53143 is still surrounded by a disk of rock debris. As these rocks move, they're constantly colliding with each other, crashing on impact and turning into dust. Usually such disks are ring-shaped and resemble the Kuiper belt. But this one has a completely unusual crown or ellipse shape. And this is not the star's only strange and unique feature. During further observations, astronomers noticed that it has another inner disk, offset or tilted relative to the outer disk. The unusual thing is that the larger disk should gradually attract, destroy and absorb the smaller one. Scientists have come to the conclusion that there's one possible scenario. If there's an object hiding in the system, its gravity might allow the disk to maintain distance. But this object would have to be at least a large exoplanet. To test their theory, astronomers will have to thoroughly search the entire vicinity
this hurricane eventually turned the jets of gas into an hourglass shape. Large plasma outbursts occur about every eight years. Such fountains of plasma have particularly stunned scientists. By all rules, there shouldn't be any. It takes remarkable energy to release such jets. So where does the dying star get that energy? One theory is that a sort of space vampire may be involved in the story, disguised as the star's good neighbor. There may be an invisible companion star orbiting close to V-Hydrae that affects this ejection mechanism. Part of the gas is sucked into space and forms an amazing hourglass-shaped structure. But the show of the dying V Hydra pales into comparison to what the star from the Eta Carinae binary system did. About 170 years ago, it started to lose its shell, and star B began to hastily peel away layer upon layer of its neighbor, consuming its gas and matter. As a result, star A was turned into a helium core. After that, the gravitational balance of forces in the system changed. Star B, swollen at the expense of the neighbor's shell, pushed A farther from the center, closer to star C. Eventually, C crashed into B, and there was an explosion. It was very strong, but not enough to destroy the huge star B. Instead, the small C star was blown into pieces. And so the system became binary, with stars A and B remaining. Scientists will continue to search for arguments in favor of this hypothesis, using computer simulations and the new James Webb Space Telescope. Speaking of the James Webb Space Telescope, what new phenomena do you think it's going to find? Let us know in the comments. And to be sure you don't miss out on new things being discovered in the universe, stay tuned here by subscribing. Thanks for watching.